Yo, what's up guys? DJ Mega Man here back with another video. And this video is going to be my first GTA 5 online tutorial. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to get the black duffel bag in GTA 5 online after patch 1.50 or the Diamond Casino Ice patch. Now, for this glitch, you will need a terabyte. You will need a terabyte to get the black duffel bag. You also will need a helicopter, an oppressor mark II, or any other air vehicle that you can parachute out of. Now, before we get into this video, I'm going to need you guys to smash that like button and hit that subscribe. Like, if you're not subscribed, what are you, what, what are you, why are you here? But anyways, guys, let's get right into this video. I'm not going to hold you. Now, for this first step. All you want to do is pick the outfit you want to get the black duffel bag onto. Doesn't matter what your character is on or what the outfit is. Doesn't matter. Any outfit that you want to get the black duffel bag on. Now, for the second step, all you're going to want to do is go inside your terabyte. And then once it loads, all you're going to want to do is go inside the touch screen. And then you want to go to client jobs. And then you want to go to robbery in progress and confirm. And now once that confirms, all you're going to want to do is go in back inside your touch screen. And then you're, all you want to do is search for whatever bank the robbery is being held at. Now, once you find which bank the robbery is at, all you're going to want to do is press X or A on Xbox to go inside the cameras. And then you want to find the robber that has the duffel bag. And now once you see that, are going to do is exit your terabyte and then once you exit your terabyte all you're going to want to do is hop in your oppressor mark 2 or get in your helicopter or whatever air vehicle you're using for this glitch and all you're going to want to do is head to the bank that the robbery is at And once you're almost there, there's going to be a few cops in the front. All you just want to do is take them out. And once you take them out, there's going to be a juggernaut with the minigun. So you're going to have to take him out too. It's easier to use a rocket launcher or if you have minigun or the laser minigun. Which as you can see here, well, I didn't get him with the minigun, but I used my grenade launcher. And once you take him out, all you're going to want to do is head into the bank, kill the last two bank robbers, and then you want to grab the duffel bag. And then once you grab the duffel bag, all you're going to do is head out of the bank. And once you head out of the bank, you're going to have the cops, so you're going to have to get back on your oppressor or helicopter very quick. And then all you want to do is lose the cops. Now, once you lose the cops, all you're going to do is get some height and fly over the checkpoint. All you want to do is fly over it or fly near it. And once you get close enough and you think you're high enough, you want to jump off 
your oppressor or jump out of your helicopter and then you want to pull your parachute and this is an important part this is very important you want to land on the checkpoint you don't want to land next to it you don't want to land near it or land on the ground and then walk to it you want to land on the checkpoint and once you land on the checkpoint all you're going to do is call back your oppressor or helicopter And then once you get your oppressor back or helicopter, all you're going to want to do is head to the nearest gun store. Now, once you get to the gun store, all you're going to do is go inside. Then you want to go to browse weapons and then you want to go to parachutes. And then you want to go to parachute bags. And then you want to go to, I think, number 25. Yeah, number 25, the Israel shoot bag. You need to get the Israel shoot bag for this glitch. And then all you want to do is put the Israel shoot bag on. So it looks like that on your character. Then you want to get back on your oppressor or helicopter. And then you want to head over to the mask store. Now this is another important part. You want to go high enough in the air to where you could parachute in front of the mask store. Now, once you think you get high enough, all you want to do is jump off your oppressor or helicopter. And you basically want to do the same thing that you did for the mission. And you want to land in front of the mask store. Now, what you're going to want to do when you land is you want to spam right on D-pad. Like right here. You want to spam right on D-pad. And then it should put you in. And you want to go to edit saved outfits. And if you see that the parachute, it shows the parachute on, that's how you know you did the glitch right. Now, all you're going to want to do is save this outfit. Save it into another slot or just re-save it into whatever slot it was on. And you, when you come out, all you need to do is equip the outfit. And there you go. You should have the black duffel bag. Well, that was it for the video, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thank you guys for watching. And you already know one more time, gotta remind you, smash that like button, man. Like, yo, smash that. And hit that subscribe button. Turn on post notifications, all that good stuff. And I'll see you guys later. Now, one more thing, guys, to add on. Like and comment if you want to see a video on how to get these two duffel bags or any other colored duffel bags. Like and comment.